Well, hello, my friends out there. I didn't expect to make a unboxing video this soon. Uh, I ordered uh, some knives from Fast Tech in China. So, surprise, surprise, these are Chinese knives. Uh, and actually, this time it only took 12 days to get here. Uh, they flew through uh, cost, cost our Danish customs, which is uh, controlled by the, uh, the, the National Danish Postal Service. Normally it takes about 14 days, but today uh, just flew through and 12 days from China. I'm quite surprised, but that gave me an opportunity to make a sort of an unboxing video. So you just have to believe that these uh, knives uh, came in a nice bag from plastic. I don't really want to show you how I cut that open. So, without further ado, let's start with the first one, the Hans knife. Um, just to open and have a look-see. Yes, smaller than I thought, uh, definitely. A lot of standoffs. Yeah. Very flat pocket clip. Very tight. And this is the Hans Knight. And I just have to show you the Hans Talisman, which is actually why I bought it, because this one is a true gem. Very, very cheap indeed. And I thought I might try another Hans. This is even cheaper. Not very big, but uh, I'll try it out for size. I can open it. Nice satin finish blade with a bit of switches. Hollow grind. Some switch. Both sides. Wow, it's sharp. <laughs> That's kind of nice. That's what I expect in a knife anyway. And sort of the first test jumping on top here and uh, I think this is sort of a nylon handle and as I said open construction with a lot of just see if I can catch the light with a lot of standoffs and a lot of screws this will be a very funny knife to take apart but uh, I'll see what I can do I just hope they don't strip out the screws not I don't know if you can see it, I can see that it's not perfectly centered, but not bad. For a piece of time. Uh, action, quite nice, not drop shot smooth or anything. Not that smooth at all actually, but uh, the thumb studs are sitting in the right place so that you can give it a good flick. Feels very nice in hand. Pocket clip, not obtrusive in any way. This is actually a quite nice knife. A little small for my taste, but uh, not bad at all. Uh, I just wish it was a bit smoother, but uh, I can do something about that. Well, the Hans Knight. Not bad. Not by any in any way the best knife I have ever received, uh, action-wise or perhaps otherwise. But remember, four Chinese knife at fifty-six dollars can't beat the price anyway. Keep keep that price in mind. I'll just put that a little bit aside, and then we'll open this white one. Uh, don't even know what it is. Uh, the Land 910 Plus, and this is an awesome knife. Really, um, I think I already made a review of this one, but uh, I just wanted another one in another color. I have this black one, and now I have a green one. And the action is phenomenal on these. And actually fit and finish everything, even the plate is rounded off very nicely. And this is, I think, out of the box, 
in every way as nice as the other one. Perfectly centered. As I said, this one you can look at a review, uh, on my other review on this one, I just wanted another. But this, quite nice to see that uh, quality control is consistent. This is, feels equally as good as the other one. Out of the box, I admit, but still. Then we have two cans of knives. And the first one is a black G751, sorry, C75, 7511, and then black. We'll just open and see. A pouch. Don't use it, but yeah, it's there. Silica gel is also a nice thing. Nice thing. This one, some uh, details on the scale here, G10 scale I think, I'll just try it on for size, I just have to give it a little more, flat grind, and then a switch on the top, a little bit of thumb rest up here, this is very nice in the hand indeed. Yeah. Nice fit and finish. That ram, that uh, jimping is not very abrasive, but uh, yeah, I guess it holds on, holds on a bit to your finger. I really like that blade shape. Right left carry for so for lifties a good thing and uh, build out inside and as I mentioned the fill and finish is quite nice very nicely rounded off um, not perfectly centered still very very beefy knife but it is it's a very good in hand. I, I really like this one. Just as yeah, you know, it's out of the box, so we'll see first impressions. Very nice. Then the last one, <coughs> the G743, uh, two and WD one. This WD is. Indicative that this is a knife with wooden scales, wood ha wooden handles. And let's see, even the pouch here. Very different design, very, very beautiful stone wash and wooden handle. handle. Quite nice. Uh, sort of a, um, a little bit of a murdery blade. Very, very pointy and very sharp. Flat mind. Mm. Oh, chip down carry uh, only right side pocket clip. Sorry, lefties. Uh, even the thumb studs just on one side. Very, very high thumb stud really sticks out. And I I don't really have to try it out to tell you that this is not very smooth. I really like the I really like the looks of this one. The design is always so nice. That pocket clip is very dominant. But let's try the action. I don't think it's it's not smooth, I can tell you that. And quite so. If I give it all the force, I can thumb flick it. Oh, this is not very smooth. And it suffers both from lack of uh, smoothness as in, in the pivot, and it has a bit of a weak descent. 
but I do love the design. That is very nice. Actually, what I think I'm gonna do is um, I'm going to make another video, try to take this one apart and see if I can make it work a bit better and then I'll take you along for the ride and, and show you how I take them apart and uh, perhaps tighten the detent, perhaps smoothen the pivot a little bit. That'll be another video, but I think I'll do that. Some of you asked about it and I think this rather nice design deserves a little bit of action shouldn't be necessary out of the box so you are warned if you buy this one but uh, well some of these Chinese knives do, do uh, require a bit of care before they really get as good as they can be but I'll do another video I promise you and then I'll show you how to how I take me my knives apart and how I lubricate them and try to make the action better. This was the unboxing of these four knives. Bit of good, bit of less good, maybe a bit of bad. But uh, anyway, you have a nice day, evening, whatever it is in your country. Bye bye.